Hello and welcome back to Boring Dead Gaming, where today we're going to be playing some more Coral Island. So a little chat to Boring Dog, see how he's doing. Oh no, I clicked on my wardrobe. But Boring Dog's happy. He's a happy little fella. See my new fully stocked kitchen, which I'll probably never use, but I might. You never know. <laughs> Could happen. Didn't happen very much in Stardew Valley either. Um, I mean, when I'm being having being showered in Jammu as I am, it doesn't... I don't really have that same need to, uh... Hmm, these all look like the same kind of plant. I'm worried they're the cotton plant. And that I won't be getting tea. Uh, but as I say, yeah, I'll, I'll probably just, uh, not have to do much cooking. But you never know. I quite like having a full, fully stocked kitchen anyway. Some more glass going. So I think the blacksmith's still working on my axe today think. But we can go, we want to go and do some uh, coffers and stuff at him, this place anyway. So we can check. I guess I'll keep putting the gourmet salt in the kitchen. I mean, why not? It doesn't, it doesn't fetch for very much money. Just going to check on the animals. I'm pleased I did this. I think it, I think it'll work a lot better. Having this like this. I'm going to check on my little apple tree as well. It's, I, I'm not sure if it is growing. I mean, it is supposed to take 28 days to grow, so I doubt we'd really see much of a difference by now anyway. But I start to feel like I would be quite surprised if... Ah. <laughs> if it did grow in winter. I'm not sure. I'm not really, I'm not really that bothered either way, to be honest. Ducky. So what I might start doing is this, if I get sort of zero or bronze star level eggs that are, are small, like not the large ones, I might um, get those in my kitchen as well. Ah, go away quackers. There we go. So this time, for instance, what did I get? Uh, they're all large. But this one doesn't have a star. I, may, I might keep that in my... Uh, ooh. Yeah, I'll probably make mayonnaise out of it, if I'm honest. Probably will. Gold star goat. Oh, very nice. Well, the goats are producing quite well already. What a star. Oh, they've only got four hearts. There we go. Right, let's go in the shed and uh, get some stuff going. Did I have three duck eggs? Like, oh, it must have given me an extra one. Uh, so we got large cow milks, large goat milk. These are done. Have I got any fish things in here? I don't actually. I need. Uh, I'll need some more taro roots though to go in the juices. <laughs> What's going on with the door sounds on there now? Um, these are still seeds. Did I not pick up the oak thing? Oh well. Right, goat milk to process. Salt to go in my kitchen. Ah, 
I'm gonna keep a goat milk in there for now. Why not? What time is it? It's almost time for the blacksmith to open, so why don't we go up over there? Oh, let's get some uh, gold kelp going as well. Perfect. Getting the hang of that. In terms of the metal ores, I mean, I've got quite a lot of bars of everything except bronze, and I don't really want to make more until I know kind of what I'm using them for. Uh, how's that all stuff going? It's actually finished, so we need to... Mm. Hopefully I remember to edit that out, but if not, that was just my dog going absolutely nuts for, for some reason. I'm not sure. I probably hear someone, another dog barking outside. It sits behind me and then just suddenly erupts. Guess the absolute living daylights out of me. <laughs> Every time. I feel like my washing can on right here as well. Uh... Yeah, I think we just do the blacksmith next. I don't think I've got enough scrap to get even more glass going, so we'll just leave that for now. Oh, I got a happy little happy little bonbon and a monarch caterpillar. Woof woof. I mean, I mind you, he was closed yesterday, which might mean that I have my axe today, thinking about it. It's certainly a possibility. Yeah. Right, well, let's open some coffers now. And geodes. Ooh, red barrel might be new. Black opal is not, though, I don't think. That's going to be new, I think. And well, that's probably new as well, actually. Alright, so let's get this uh, axe in its pride of place. I guess the question is, should I do these now? So the hoe, right? How much, What do I need for the hoe? Uh, five bronze bars I can do. Twenty woods, yeah. Okay, maybe we'll do that. Might as well, right? Yeah, that's new. Ooh, the barrel is a temple offering as well. That's good. Okay, so let's do the temple offering first then. I imagine maybe it's this one. No, maybe this one. Uh, is it, a, it says it's a precious gem, so that's pretty cool. Should do that really. That's the only real one I can do right now. And I guess some of this stuff is going to need to be in an aging barrel, which I haven't got access to yet. So what's on the more basic cooking then? What, what can I do? Smoothie, grilled fish, sunny side up eggs, tomato soup, onigiri. I don't have the recipe for that yet. Uh, fruit plants. These bat wings, I've just, I, I mean, yesterday in the mine I killed absolutely loads of stuff and uh, didn't get a single bat wing. I might have to Google what type of enemy actually drops them. Have I not donated a Monarch Caterpillar yet? I thought I had. Oh, I've got loads of those. I I suppose I've maybe I donated it to the temple and didn't ever donate it there. Oh, that's a possibility. All right, so let's drop off some of these gems and stuff. Okay, that'll do 
ready for now. This thing's there. Take my trash again. Um. Yeah, I guess I'll leave that for now. Oh no, I need 20 wood, don't I, for the uh, hoe. And all five of my bronze bars. So I'm going to get another five going then off the ore. I need 25 of this. And five coal, which I've got quite a good stock of at the moment. isn't doing much yet. Uh, right, back to blacksmith. There was another border fly. Oh, olive wing. I'm making his little tail up there. What that says one day, which presumably will be tomorrow. They said that for the um, fishing rod as well, and that was still had to be two days before it was done. Uh, what am I doing now? I might go to the... I'll tell you what, we'll walk there and we'll see if we can see any forageables on the way. By there, I mean the, the new woods where the, the hardwood lives. What's that? Leaf beetle? I think that might be new. It is. That's good. Oh, that's just a wasp, but there's some bamboo up there. Uh, I was going to say I'll get that as well, but it's the... Uh, yeah. Just put my hoe in the shop. I won't be doing that for a little while. So I'll probably try and go straight to silver after I've got it back as well. Just get all my tools to gold minimum this winter. Oh, Yeah. Never mind. stutters a lot. I don't know why it stutters so much. That's why I miss out on a lot of stuff, because it stutters and by the time it's caught up something's already flown away. It's my excuse anyway. Oh, another one here. I don't think I'll do the mine today, but I might go and do some undersea stuff after this. Oh. Another one of them. All right, how many hits is this going to take? Takes a few. Ooh, ginseng. A couple of ginseng. Lovely jubbly. I can see something else flapping around there, but I can't really see because it's... Oh, no, maybe it was just uh, greenery. Uh, I, think, I think that's done for now. The wood. Oh, that's another raffles here. Put that in a beehive. I think it's worth a couple of grand, the honey. And that might be it for this season. Apparently only two or three of them ever ever spawn in a season. Like the uh, the other one, the Titan Arum. Oh, I might have like an oak essence or something I didn't grab earlier. 
Did I did it fall on the ground and I didn't get it, or did it? Huh, weird. Right, so uh, I'll take my trash back as ever. Um, probably keep that in this one. We've got a bunch of stuff to sell. And that goes to donate, so we'll go do that quickly. Oh, it doesn't show what we're working towards, but... I think the main one's probably the stamina upgrade. Not too far off being able to afford another one. I'm actually going to look at the town errands as well and see if I've got anything there. Oh, got another ground beetle or whatever that is. Aha! Another duck egg! Put the duck eggs in today, so I might... Um, yeah, I think, I think that'll be okay. I think we'll be able to have another duck egg by day zero on that errand. Right, we'll go back to the farm and then we'll go back to the ocean and I'll do a bit of stuff there uh, for the rest of the day. I might check the lab as well. Has it been what, only one or two days since I did the the upgrade thing. It might only be one day. So I can wait till tomorrow. Let's go diving. With that trap as well, I might move that and the insect trap into the new bit of the wood actually. And I might try and stay diving until night time because she was going on about those was it arrow crabs? They're around at night. Didn't say at what depth is the only thing, but... Um, oh, hello. That was nice and easy. Uh, is that... We've only got the one here as well. I mean, I dare say I'm going to have to clear a route for it, but that was pretty simple. Probably make me clear off more or less every scrap of rubbish around here anyway. That's going back this way, so yeah. Highlighted anything else, so I'll just keep swinging away. Oh no, there's one down here. I'm gonna go around again, what looks like it. It's going to make me clean up pretty much everything anyway. Is that it? Oh, no. I 
think that's it though. That's pretty neat. Go over this way, I guess. Oh, Tentacles here. Are they still going to retract? Yeah, they are. Oh, this is as well. It's starting to feel a bit like we're building towards something, doesn't it? sort of the final stages for the coral or something. Oh, that's like a little sea anemone there. That's exactly what it is. Okay, so we've hit a fence. What are we doing? Okay. We've got the cave. Well, there's three in this area, isn't there? So I guess we, I guess we start looking for them. Oh, got one already. I'm just going to keep looking through, to be honest. We'll work our way down to it. We might find more on the way. I still think it was a decent strategy. Let's click off up there now. Okay, so it's blocked on something else, obviously. Let's go and clear it, I suppose. going.
we done now? Let's go back up to this bit now that's done. To be honest, I don't know if there's much point even looking in that trash cave because that's kind of what they're there for, to be trash. And I don't really need much more of that at the moment. I don't suppose the sea anemone is a temple offering. No, but it's a donation. crabs as well. Okay, well I've got one more. I mean... I've done most of it. I guess there's a few odds and sods around. So I'll just loop around this area and see like, the odd patches that I've missed. They've probably got it. fish there, but I don't think that's one I can catch. I think that's just sort of a background detail. Okay, I'll be, I'll be honest. Um, I've pretty much done all this now. I get, well, okay. Oh, was this blocked off before? Yeah, I reckon it was. Okay, I did see there was another sea anemone there, but I kind of want to keep searching for the the relic for the one down the way. Which I'm guessing might not be too far off. Could be completely wrong on that, of course. I just haven't found it. I don't know where it's hiding out. Because we're we're getting up towards these ones now. Ah, okay. Okay, which way are you going to go? You're going to go down or up? He's going up, so... Alright. I kind of before we get into up into this here, I kinda of, I kinda of want to activate this one, so I'm gonna go back down here and just check what bits I've missed. So I feel like I shouldn't really move on up is that rubbish? There's a few here. Where's the shark? Apparently you mostly catch the shark in the summer, I think I was reading, so I don't really hold out too much hope of doing it in this season. I guess there were maybe a few down here I didn't clear, so we'll maybe do a bit more of that. I 
But again, it's kind of getting down to the last few things, really. One lump there. There's all this, but... I just don't feel like it would belong to that. I guess I don't have a lot of choice but to do it, though. Late, but I'm like, I, don't know, I just wanted to find it today. I'll take another Jamu. I'm going to keep going for a while. It was not too boring to watch. I know some people find it quite chill, but I find it quite chill. I know some people like it just to sort of have on in the background and be a bit soothing. Like, submarine. ASMR. <laughs> sort of clearing all this stuff as well and not finding it. Well, I think probably the only thing I can do then is to just carry on kind of around this area. I think there might be a fence there. It's possible there's trash on like maybe this side that, that links to that. And I have to go up and do the other area first. It wouldn't be the first time something like that had happened. Kind of just going back now to where I left off, just up here, just so I can bring the anchor down, get back to it quickly next time. I feel like I probably found quite a lot of coffers today. Yeah, so I'm going to work up this way next time. How many coffers did I get? Uh, not as many as you'd think, actually. trap for now. I can't bother to move. It's too late. <laughs> Just need to get back, really. Uh, 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 God, everything kind of needs sorting out before bed, but... Um, oh, no, I need to donate that, don't I? Sort a few things out quickly. Uh, let's do the dehydrator. Is that it? Okay. Eight tarot root in there quickly. I 
Getting late! I'll sell those two and we'll donate that one to the museum. Probably even tomorrow at this point. Uh, okay. Fill those machines up with trash, trash again. Ooh. Actually, I want to get. Apparently, you can keep going till two a.m. Although, if you're exhausted, you'll after midnight you don't got full stamina. Oh, what am I thinking? I'm thinking another fifty of these. Get to bed. I'm not even going to check the telly. Let's just get straight to bed. It's very late. Okay, catching's up. Flying insect insect scent. All right, that's good. Uh, not too bad. Not too bad on the old money front for winter. Hello, this is Boring Dad from the Future. Um, I mucked up the beginning of this day a little bit, but basically what, what, what I was doing, I was uh, kind of explaining that probably moving forward in winter when there isn't a lot to do on the farm and it's all sort of kind of the same thing each day, what I'm probably going to do is, uh, is have days where I'm just going to go out, spend a day fishing like I, I did on this particular day, trying to go to different spots, catch different types of fish. Maybe I might have... I go in the ocean just going around and collecting different types of kelp. Again, probably not the most interesting thing to watch. Um, but I'll I'll sort of do episodes where I can maybe come back after a couple of days and say, oh, this is what I did, this is what we found. Um, did find some interesting stuff at the end of this day. Got a couple of donations for the museum and one for the temple, I think. Uh, but I'm probably going to pause it again here and we'll come back towards the end of this day and just kind of round things off. And uh, yeah, end the episode there. So thanks very much and I'll see you soon. Okay, so here we are. I did change locations as I was only catching the same three fish over and over again in the mine, uh, which were uh, mackerel, as we know. I also caught sardines, which is a temple offering, so I was quite pleased with that. I was also catch caught these giant mud skippers, which is a museum donation, so again, quite pleasing. Boxfish, again, for the uh, museum, uh, from, my, from where I have been just now. And I was also catching a lot of mackerel there, too. A lot of mackerel today. Um... But we're going to go quickly to the temple. Get that fish in. Probably a common fish. Sardine, there we go. Uh, I need a minimum of a silver one, but I've actually got a gold one I can stick in there. Yeah, so a few of these to go. Um, cool, but let's quickly pop over to the museum and get some stuff in there. So we'll donate, I guess, the silver one of those and silver one of those. That's about it for that. I worry too much about these machines, but I'd like to pop into the shed and just grab like any cheese or anything like that that's just got finished. And that flour too. Uh, so we can put these into cell. I guess we'll take these two. Getting late! Flour. Oh, inventory's full. Uh, I can come back in a sec once I've chop the wood. Do that. 
Leave those for now. Oh, no, I want to go to the sail bin, don't I? I'm going to keep some fish for cooking, I think. Um... I'll put the I'll put the nice expensive ones in here. So ginseng those. Definitely the osmium ones. Maybe I'll keep the silver mackerel. Put all the mud skippers in. The box fist is poisonous, so I probably don't want to doing that really. Oh, I've got another olive wing there as well to sell. Right, let's toss this stuff in some in the kitchen quickly. We've got some flour, we've got some fish now. That's for my hoe, which I won't get tomorrow, but maybe the day after that. And we're going to bed. Foraging leveled up. We've got some hedges. It's quite nice. Uh, no skill point, but some more max stamina. Fishing, we do get a skill point. We actually get medium, but I was using some small bait at points there. I didn't really notice the difference in the type of fish I was catching when I was using it, though. I was trying to see if I could catch a legendary hammerhead, which is apparently available at that ocean lookout in winter. But I didn't, uh, I didn't get it yesterday. That's good. Uh, 9k, not bad. So fishing was okay. Oh, I mean, osmium sardine, only 70. The crab wasn't... Well, yeah, the crabs weren't too bad. Doesn't really like you make as much money from fishing as you do from the other activities. But I might... Maybe I can put a perk on to increase that a bit. Cool. Okay, well, I think we'll leave it there for now. So when we come back, we'll do some more. What I'll probably do even is just race through some days just fishing in various spots because I'd like to, you know, kind of up the variety of fish that I've caught um, which I won't do on camera I'll just say I've spent the last couple of days doing this I'll see, I'll see how I feel but thanks very much for watching this episode and if you've enjoyed this if you can hit the thumbs up button that'd be great uh, leave me a comment let me know what you think about this episode about the series in general always great to hear your thoughts and if you're watching this and haven't already subscribed to the channel it'd be great if you could do that as well so thanks very much and I hope to see you next time for more Coral Island bye for now